Hey guys, thanks for joining me this week. Uh, we're going to be picking up where we left off last week. We're going to be doing um, the sink. So we're going to be putting the sink faucet in and we're going to be fixing this uh, latch on this window over here. And then we'll pick up where we're at today. So today I'm going to be taking this uh, fluorescent light off and we're going to be converting it over to a warm white, cool white LED strip. Still don't know how I'm going to do it fully. Um, I got some switches. I got a dimmer. And hopefully it'll be just like these other lights that we put in here, uh, but a little bit brighter. So let's get busy with this. And I was having a problem with that thing. With this latch on there. I can't get it to go past. Like notch down here. It looks like it might be caught it out. So I was going to take it off, see if I can't fix that. Let's uh, back this thing out. Let's see if we can't see what's wrong with this here. Looks like this might be bent a little bit too, doesn't it? I guess that'll work. Let's uh, let's put it back on. I like those kinds of projects. Quick, simple. Now I can open this window and let some air through here. Leave that open. Um, I think I was going to do the sink next, put that faucet in. So I've got a, do you want to see what I got? Let's see what I got. A white curved faucet that pulls out. So I'm going to have to find the low point and drain the water in this thing. So if I can figure out where that is, I haven't found that. I haven't looked for that. All right, here we are. We just got out of here. Let's up and look in here. There's a hose right there that goes up underneath that tank. I've seen that hanging down before. Let's go look up in where the water valves are. Let's see. This is for the water heater. So that's in the water heater, out of the water heater bypassing the water heater. Those hoses up there, PEX goes to the bathroom. So those two that are going that way, those must go to the sink. That right there must be, that's the supply. Um, shut. Let's shut this off. Let's shut the water heater off, shut that off, we'll open the bypass, is there a valve down there? I can't see that, nope, maybe that's, uh, maybe the drain is inside, let's go inside and look underneath that step, alright, let's look under here, Yeah, this is from the water tank this side. This goes out, fill. Look at all the wires in this thing. They're all bundled, wrapped, secured. Let's, uh, let's open that valve down there. How can you guys sit? Oh. So that's a drain for the tank. There's, this one is a drain. For everything. Oh, yeah, there it goes. I wonder if we open some of these faucets and see if we get anything. There's a hole in that one up there. So. Oh, they are sucking air. I heard a little bit of water come out, but not very much, huh? Well, maybe it's all drained out of there. Who knows? Let's pull it off, see what we get. I think I can reach everything I need through here. Let's uh, reach up in here. Oh, yeah. There's a little water in there. Happy Jack remote all wet. Not much water, but it's water. Let me grab a towel and soak that up. I think I'm going to end up taking this floor out of this and then I think this is where I'm gonna put all of the stuff for the 
solar. I hear thunder. Whoop, more water. There's one. Everything should be to the sides, but. All right, got the center one, second one, second one off. Squeeze that out. This should come off. Oh, there's a third hole in the sink, but not drilled through the countertop. Looks like a one inch hole. Let me go get a one inch bit. All I could find was this bit, which is made for tile and uh, concrete countertops. But it should go through here. It's on a little piece of wood right now. Here's plug. Right on. Oh, that's filthy too. Let me see if I can get clean. All right. Found some Clorox. Look at that. <laughs> that's disgusting. What? Scum coming off. What do we got? I got a plate that's gonna cover everything. It only uses one hole. Maybe we could have just offset it to one side. Well, actually, we can't because of this. Not feasible. This guy down. Need one of these. It's the hot air. It's the cold. All right. Very nice. It's got. Stream. Let's see. I have no idea what that is. That looks like an There's a weight. Where is my. Uh... Screw to hold this thing down. Does this have. Oh. They're using this thing. Got a rubber seal, washer, and this. This is kind of nice. Why does this seem like it's big? It's hard to get up there. All right, that looks centered to me. Let's tighten this thing down. Okay, we'll have to find something to convert from this to the male side in order to get this finished. So this weight, looks like they've got a, uh, come on over here. Weight, he. I think that means weight here. Weight here. Look at that. That's all we can do right now. Uh, all right, let's clean up this mess. There it is, cleaned up. Throw it out the back door. All right. What else can we do? My skylight came. Let's get this. I've already taken this off. It's just sitting up there. Here it is. All right, let's go uh, outside. All right, there is the old one. Let's pull the new one out and set them side by side. Wow, my, the new one looks much larger for some reason. It was supposed to be a little smaller, not larger. That is a lot larger. Where is my tape measure? This is 21 and a half. Just this is 22 inches. Their measurements are of this, not the full thing. When they said overall, they didn't mean the tab. So this is a 14 and a half, not a 22. 
if I want to put this up there with being that big. Let me do some research and see. Everything they were saying was overall, right? Outside to outside. But when you get it, they're actually measuring the width of the bulge here. Jeez, I had to wait two weeks to get that. To get the wrong thing. Imagine that. Ah. I don't know, I've been looking around, I haven't found anything. I think I'm gonna head over to the camper and try to do some research, see if I can't find something else, a local distributor or something. All right, I will uh, catch you guys tomorrow, I guess. We'll see you then. Well, you're not gonna believe this. So I went back and searched Facebook Marketplace. Lo and behold, there was two of them on there the exact ones i need can you believe that i can't we get to put the skylight back in there so that's nice look at the quality difference you can see through see through those you can't even see through these this one's all crazed it's pretty old awesome can't believe it save my bacon let's get these um i don't even know what i'm gonna do Oh, I picked up some fittings, some half inch to three eighths inch quarter turn. So this is flat. This is for compression. I can, we got tons of threads on there. So I'm just gonna file off or grind off a little bit to make that flat so that that gasket will seal on there. And then I'll just crimp this onto that pack that's under there and get rid of the, the 90 that's on there right now with the compression fitting for the regular faucets. I think that'll do. Can't take off this first thread. Start. Start there. There it goes. All right, we'll do that to the other one and then we'll go put these on. Let's cut these off. Go. <clears throat> All right, so we put the clamp on, and this is not gonna fit up in there. Oh, I tell you, what size is this? Three eighths. Okay, and two. on now I ended up getting the uh, or first time I got the uh, PEX A connectors whoops I really needed the PEX B connectors oh look at that it's so much easier Shooting up in there. Not in there. Okay. Lines. Blue. Oh, it's got a screen in it. Already. That's good. Alright, there's one. 16 millimeter. We'll plug out there. Tighten this 
したな。Okay. So I'm gonna guess that's on. Let's go turn the water pump on and we'll see what we got. All right, water.、Uh, two thirds. Water pump on. Sink is running. Ooh. Water pump's off. Let's try this. Do we have that off somewhere? Let's go look. What do we got here? Faucet soft outside.、Um, uh, which one's off? This is off. There we go. Is that right? In out. I think so. Let's go try it. Still nothing on there. Hmm. We have air in the hot water tank. We don't want to run too much water. Tanks. So why is? We gotta find that valve. There's a valve off. All the valves are on. What's going on? Oh, there's a kink in this. Okay. Well, that should work now. Hey, look at there. Nice. Filthy. That is done. Next project. All right, let's do this. It is raining out like mad. I got here; it was pouring rain. All right, so this thing is still live. So I'm gonna drop this cover. We'll probably find a ballast under there. It's bit in here. Sure is. This ballast cover is riveted on. We are gonna open that up. I'll have to drill those out. Let's、uh, let's open this thing up and see what all the secrecy is here. That rivet in the middle is probably holding the ballast in. Out one way or another. It's held in there. Hanger is flooding, as usual. Oh, we're gonna have to use those. We're gonna have to re-rivet this. Those rivets that were holding the ballast cover on were also holding these end caps in. The riveter will rivet these end caps in. Any more wire? Just in case. Pop those off. The rivets. I broke that one. Okay, so I got those re-riveted. I riveted them from this side because this is plastic, and if you rivet it from this side, it just kind of spreads out and breaks the. I don't know if you can see that, but it breaks the plastic.、Um, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to be doing in here. I know I'm going to be taking these and running them back and forth in here. I think I'm just going to bend them. I'm not going to cut them and splice them. I think I'm going to、uh, finish this up, and then、uh, I'll show you what I did. When we're done, oh, all right, guys. I took the LEDs. I still have quite a bit left, I guess.、Uh, but I strung them back and forth in here. There's one, two, three rows there, three rows there, two rows there, and then on this side, this is the original switch. I put another switch in, so this one. One of these, I don't know which one, is going to be for cool white, and one's going to be for warm white. And then you can turn them both on. And this can be a dimmer as well as a power switch. I got some wire nuts here. Let's、uh, let's power this up and see what we get. 
I hope we don't get like fire. But in order to get that uh, this potentiometer, the dimmer to fit, I had to grind the sides because this is curved, right? Otherwise, it didn't stick out far enough, and I nicked the motherboard. So let's uh, let's just strip these and see white to white. The red or positive. Okay. We're wired up. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Cool. So this new switch is cool white. The old switch is warm white. We have on off. I guess you could put them both to the left. Well, that's kind of nice. The new one, the, the white one is cool white and the dirty one is warm white. They match the colors. And the dimmer works. Well, I am excited about that. Hallelujah. We'll leave those out so we can get it over further. There we go. I think we can use the original holes. One original hole. It's my battery jug now. Yeah. These big old wire nuts have been, I'm sure they'll shadow. Does this thing go up in here? There it is. Wow, that's bright. There's some shadowing in there from those wire nuts. Uh, maybe I'll fix that if it annoys me. But there it is, guys. That's pretty bright. Cool. It kind of matches the other warm white. That's good. All right, let's see uh, what else. Okay, we got the... Uh, Skylight here. I was looking at the other one. The other one had a vent in it. I took the vent out of the other one. Oh, I see. They just got it drilled. And I'm going to drill it out and put the other vent in there that we have. We're just going to make this hole larger. Perfect. That has it up on its side. Of it. Let's try to shake that out. Come on. Come on, Neil. Whoa. Oh, there. It fell right up. All right. Awesome. Good. Lucky me, huh? i put this uh, o ring I had back in this hole. That's nice. In there. There it goes. That will stick this guy in this hole. There. Now it's vented and it keeps everything out. Let's go. Set it. Okay. That is all the way around covering all of the Holes where we're going to put screws. I'll go up on the roof. I'll put some VHB tape up there. Okay. One more. Clean one. Uh, corner. Turn around here. Got one foot on the ladder and one foot in the loft. Ooh. Okay, there is our VHB tape. So, I just shut the hangar door. It's like we're in Mad Max out here. Dust storm is blowing through and it's crazy. You can't see a quarter mile, There's so much dust. Where's my little drilled hole? We'll put it over on that side. Pretty good around the opening too. I wonder if I had to take that inside off. It kind of looks like I need to. Let's pull this off. Push this bottom down. Let's just pull all this paper off. Pull that bottom's down. This is a polycarbonate skylight. I'll just drop it back down and push down around the edges. 
Oh, it really heats up in here with no air circulation. Grab some of these screws. These are like tech screws. All right, guys, I'm not gonna open a tube of die core for this. I think what we can do though, this vent is gonna get replaced. So let's pull these. This is gonna get a max air instead of this little fan for the bathroom. Okay, all right, let's go. Uh, let's go downstairs and we'll disconnect this. It smell dust in the air. Let's look outside. Uh, gee, look at that. Man, it is so dirty out here. Oh my God. I can smell it and taste it. Can you see the dirt in the reflections coming through those holes? The one I got right here, it's got a magnetic cover on it. So we'll go pull that other one out and we'll stick this one in or get it fit anyway. Oh, look at that. You can see outside. All right, we've got this come on? Find out what happens when we take this off. This trim ring. Stopper. Alright. Am I missing something there? I could just goes right through it. It's a cute little junction box. <laughs> can, can you see that? The wires go straight through the junction. My medical grade wire cutters. It's very solid. Oh. oh. Hey, we can get it from over here instead of climbing up there. <laughs> Alright, it's coming up. Alright, there it goes. So that side goes. Oh gosh. In the bathroom. Clean this up. Am I gonna be able to reach the other side? We might be able to reach it. Oh my goodness, I got all kinds of I got all kinds of reach. Get that out of the way. I've got the fan. Stuff to clean with. Oh, let's clean this up. You hear the wind moving the hangar doors. Uh oh. Make sure it's gonna fit. Yep. Pretty standard, I guess. Or right, let's take the paper off of the butyl. So these, when you set this, you want these screws on the outside, inside and outside. These guys right here, these screws. Of course, there's screws all around this thing, right? That's down. And this thing sits on there. And then it's held on to that with four screws. Clean that off. Nice, real nice. I'm pretty sure I need to cut this flange down. 
to match my rough. Looks like we need to cut it about uh, in half. Hey, I'm sitting here editing this video and I don't know what happened to this other footage. Uh, but basically, I took that flange outside, cut it down on the bandsaw, cut it down to half, put it back in, and then I went upstairs on the roof and finished resealing everything. Uh, sealed around the fan, sealed the skylight, uh, did that with the Dicor caulk. After that, I started doing the uh, rescreening. So we'll pick this up at rescreening. I don't know, lots of footage, who knows? Hey! All right, so I'm going to be doing some screening. I just rescreened this rear door. Uh, it's a heavy duty screen. I haven't screened anything in a while. So I did that one first. But, um, I'm going to got enough to do the other three windows. Uh, so we got this right here. Where should we put you? Where do you want to sit? Can you see everything? All right. Gotta figure out where this cord is. Hopefully I can reuse all of this cord. I think my screening tool's too big for this track. Sure looks too big. Looks at a pin in the bomb. Let's see what we got here. Where's my tool? Start this. Yeah, let's this thing will roll it in there. Uh, yeah, kind of. Not all the way, though. Whoops. This is like the third thing I've screened my entire life. My second thing was the door. Go around this again with this thing. Just to make sure this cord is all the way down in there. Turned out all right. Pretty taut. Happy with that. There's a knife or whatever you got. Whoops. Cut off your excess. Heavy duty screen should keep bears out and everything. I think by the time we get up to uh, Alaska, the mosquitoes and everything are going to be gone, sleeping, dead, incubating, hibernating. I don't even know what a mosquito does. There. That looks pretty good. Pretty, it's really pretty taut. Bang, 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 bang. All right, where's that one? All right, here's another one. This is the kitchen. This cord is pretty, uh, pretty elastic yet. If I get the 90. Okay. It's kind of wrinkly, but once you get this cord down in there where it's supposed to go, it really pulls it halfway tight. Flathead screwdriver over here for these corners. Actually pushes it down in there. Cool. Clip this. Cut the excess screen. Alright, there's three. Looks nice. Huh? What do you think? Can you even tell? Let me go install this and I'll grab the one out of the bedroom. It's a little floppy. I wonder if I have enough screen. Screen. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Got enough to do a whole house. All right. Let's screen this. <laughs> Last one. Start it. Good. 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 Oops. Pull it top just a little bit. Okay. Alrighty. Home stretch. Roll her out. There we go. At the end. Cut your access. Okay. Oh my gosh. Done. As long as nothing catastrophic happens right now. There. It's pretty good tension on there. Last one. Let's go put this in. Okay. 
here we are. We got the spring clips on the top. Push them up and put the bottom in the track. There it is. This is an emergency window too. Opens up, right. bail out if you need to. Put a catio out there. Let's get out of here. All right guys, that is gonna wrap up this video. If you hunt around to the end, I appreciate it. Give me a thumbs up, really helps me out. Uh, anything I used on this video, potentiometers, switches, anything like that, uh, would be listed down below. So let's check out the girls. What are you doing? You're doing what you always do. Yeah, you want your grass? She loves her grass. Oh. <laughs> oh God. She gonna shove her nose down in it. What? Quit filming me. This, she likes to tear it out at the roots. You love your grass, huh? Whoa, got grass fly. Oh, it's something on your head. <laughs> You're a whack job. You're a whack job. I can't. Stop it. Stop it. No. No, let's go find your sister. Sister. Savannah. Uh, I don't know. She ain't coming out. All right. Till next time, guys. Appreciate you. See you later. Bye.